everyone welcome to the channel so here we are discussing the question bika says the question states that in the summer bika likes to visit her country house there is everything for relaxation comfortable swings bicycles and the river there is a wooden bridge over the river consisting of n planks it is quite old and unattractive so bika decided to paint it and in the shed they just found cans of paint of k color after painting each plank one of k colors vika was about to go sw swinging to take a break from it however she realized that house was on other side of the river and the paint had not yet completely dried so she could not walk on the bridge yet in order not to spoil the appearance of bridge vika decided that she would walk on it but only stepping on plank of the same color otherwise a small layer of paint on her sole will spoil the plank of another girl vika also has a little paint left but it will only be enough to repaint one plank of the bridge now vika is standing on the ground in front of the first plank to walk across the bridge she will choose some planks of the same colors after repainting which have numbers i1 to im which are from 1 to n planks are numbered from 1 from left to right then vika will have to cross i1 minus 1 i2 minus i1 minus 1 and so on planks as a result of each of m plus 1 plan. since vika is afraid of failing she does not want to take too long step help her and tell her the minimum possible maximum number of planks she will have to cross in one step if she can repaint one plank a different color while crossing the bridge so here looking at the example first we are given the number of planks in the bridge and k is given as the number of different color so here we have five planks and two different colors. so it is colored as 1 1 2 1 here each of them represent a color so in this case vika can easily repaint the middle one as one and step over the plank so as we need to output the minimum possible maximum number of planks that vika will have to step over in one step so this is zero now looking at the second case where we have 1 2 3 3 2 1 so here she can paint this plank by 2 and hence it could be 1,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,3,2,
and then we can calculate the gap by subtracting the index of the current plan from the previous occurrence of the same so here after doing this we need to subtract my one here so that the current plank is not counted so by doing this we update the previous vector to store the index of the current occurrence of each one now let the minimum number of planks be min 1 so firstly we can initialize at the maximum level so you can take a number which is greater than the constraints or simply take int max here so after taking the minimum number what we need to do is we need to iterate over colors from 1 to k as we have k colors to paint and then for each color add the remaining gap after the last occurrence of the color to the gap so this would sort the gaps in the descending order and it would ensure that the longest gaps are at the beginning so the maximum allowed gap can be calculated by dividing the longest gap by 2 and if there are at least 2 gaps we can update the result to the maximum between the result which we got by the longest gap by 2 and the second longest gap so we would update our min1 as the minimum value between the min1 and the result which we got from the longest gap and the second longest gap and finally we would return min1 as our answer so i hope you all understand this solution thanks for watching